February is heart month and the American Heart Association suggests taking a few minutes to learn about healthy food swaps that can lower your risk for cardiovascular disease. Registered dietitian Rita Smith joins us with a focus on the many options of heart healthy fats and suggestions for reducing overall fat intake. Hi, this is Rita Smith, registered dietitian at Santa Martha Jefferson Hospital. February is heart month, so it's a good time to look at the types of fats that you have in your diet. The American Heart Association suggests a slim intake of the saturated fats, which are artery clogging, and to swap out for mono and polyunsaturated fats. They're recommending 5% of your daily calorie intake to come from saturated fats. So in a 2000 calorie diet, that would be about 13 grams a day. Saturated fats include all animal fats, such as fatty meats, poultry skin, and dairy fat like cheese, butter, and whole milk. Unsaturated fats, which are healthier, include a variety of oils like olive, grapeseed, peanut, sunflower oils, as well as avocados. Unsaturated fats also include a variety of nuts like almonds, pistachios, pecans, and seeds like sunflower and sesame seeds, as well as fatty fish like tuna, salmon, and sardines. Now, fats are an important macronutrient that our body and cells need daily, but the type of fat determines if the arteries might clog a little bit faster. So you want healthier fats to reduce that LDL production in the liver, to decrease your risk for dementia, to reduce inflammation in the body. Shift over to those healthier fats a little bit at a time. So for example, when you use ground beef and chili, tacos, or meatloaf, you might switch over to fat-free turkey breast or use a soy ground beef crumbles or fill in with using half the ground beef and then more mushrooms and beans. Replace butter when you're baking with oil, applesauce, and baby fruit. And you can use oil spread or mashed avocado on your toast. Consider having meatless Mondays where it's a totally vegetarian meal for dinner. For additional nutrition and health information, you can log onto centera.com slash health wellness your nutrition questions can come to me at the station, NBC29.com. Click on the health link. Until next time, it's Rita Smith reminding you that moderation, a variety of foods, and heavy mealtime with your children are key to eating well.